Hi guys, um, I wanted to um, share this very important moment with you. I have an unboxing and it's going to be my last unboxing for I don't know how long but I think it's going to be some time. Um, I have come to the conclusion that I need to slow down and stop actually stop buying bags um, this is a crazy habit I've gotten into and I know a lot of us have said the same thing but really I you know I used to be the type of person who didn't buy anything for myself I mean everything went to you know the boys hockey bills and my husband's hockey bills and there was never anything left for me so um, when you know when I had a little extra money I went ahead and made a purchase for myself and it really started on you know like QVC and all that um, and once I made my first one it was easier to make the second one and so forth and so forth so um, I think it's getting a little crazy because really don't I have enough don't I have enough to really um, you know I, I can I have enough. That's all there is to it. So, um, I did make a purchase. It was before Christmas, and um, I said that's going to be my last one. And I did buy a few bags over the holidays and through the month of December, and I also did sell quite a few bags on eBay. So, everything's balancing out, and this is going to be it for me. Um, this was a purchase from the... Um, the Dooney and Burke outlet in Seattle and um, I dealt with a really nice SA there her name is Nicole and I purchased well I'll show you you guys know because I've been commenting in all your comments so I think you know what it's gonna be but anyway you know this is the box and I think it's seen better days, but I really do think they recycle their boxes at the outlet. So, and look at it, it's even open here. So I hope there are not any, I can't show you this the label there. I hope there are not any critters hiding away from this terrible weather we're having. Because you know what guys, today when I left this morning, it was negative four degrees. And with a wind chill of like negative 19. And it was sunny, it was beautiful out. Um... And then as the day went on, it got a little bit warmer, a little bit warmer. And um, when I drove home today, it was five degrees, a whole five degrees. And tonight we're going to have really extreme cold and we're going to have more snow. So luckily tomorrow I work from home and I won't have to deal with traveling in it. But then again, I don't get to take my bag anywhere. So it's, it's kind of a bittersweet thing. Um, anyway, opening the box. Opening the box. Peaky. I couldn't see anything in there. I want to get this packing slip out. Sorry, I should have saved you guys the all of this. All of this, you know. This way towards. Shoot. Well, this is just the shipping label, so I don't think I really have to worry about that. Um. Okay, I'm a little short, you know, guys, on my knees here, and my videotaping spot is, I have a pillow on the floor, and I'm on my knees, and this is my bed, so, um, it's a little bit silly, but that's like the best place, you know, that I can. Okay, here we go, paperwork. And it is stuffed in a, like if I was to go to the outlet store and make a purchase. And it's in a dust bag. Okay, here we go. The last handbag purchase. For, I don't know, for a while. So this is exciting. I had to make the best of this. I had to make this feeling last. Okay. 
She said this one was in the back room and it was wrapped, but I guess it doesn't mean it was all the way wrapped because I just see wrapped handles. I don't see it all in a bag. Um, my husband loves those hand movements that I make. He makes fun of me all the time with that. He always goes, what was that? What was that? And then I have to recreate it. Okay, on with the important part. Forget. And the bag is open and unzipped, so I'm just going to zip it back up. So far, so good. Ready? 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 It's a little anticlimactic when a bag comes out of this a dust bag unstuffed. It just looks kind of sad. Okay. So this is, oh, maybe I should tell you what this is. I'm sure all of you guys already know. Um, it's the small Florentine satchel in the color marine. That was my last wish list bag. It's really a pretty color. It's not quite as deep as I thought it was going to be, but I think it's looking maybe a little dry. There's absolutely no pebbling. Completely smooth pretty much all the way around. Um, zipper's good. That's a good sign. Handles. Um, pretty dark brown whip stitching. Mm, it's a little cold, but you can still smell the leather. I just scratched already my nails. Um... I don't know what I'm showing you. I'm looking at it myself, but um, just, you know, when you take a bag out, you want to kind of take a moment and get acquainted, and uh, I don't mean to bore you with that, guys. So inside, I'm glad we have a strap. Um, sometimes, you know, there's no strap in there. Um, don't eat this. I know everybody says that. And we have registration card. And then we have all the standard pockets. You guys know what they are. A zip and a slip and two cell phone pockets or two, you know. So let's let me show you this in case anybody is that even forwards or is that backwards? I can't even tell. Anyway, you know I didn't pay that. This was from the outlet. It was on sale. 50% off. Sorry. Um, I like it. I like it. I'm happy. Um, so there she is. My last purchase. I can't say for 2015, guys, because there's a lot of time left in 2015, and I don't want to put that kind of pressure on myself. I just want to say that I'm going to slow down. I'm going to, you know, make more mindful choices uh, on my bags. And I know you guys are all going to laugh at me when I come back with another purse video in about a month or two weeks, you know, because that's what we do. We say we're going to stop, and then next thing you know, we're back. Um, so, I'm joining the ranks of you guys. Um, Kate, Bags of Love, we're going to do this band together. Lori, you did good. You did. Um... Let me show you a little comparison here because these are my two very favorite colors together and this is why I had to get the marine because I got the crimson. And they just look so pretty together, don't they? Oh my gosh, I love it. I haven't carried this bag yet because the weather has been really bad. And I'm, I don't know, it's one of those bags that's so pretty you want to baby it and not carry it. I'm very notorious for doing that. Um... So, I just want to stuff this bag and, and see how it looks all stuffed, because to me this looks kind of sad. Feet.
All right, guys. I don't think I need to go over dimensions or anything like that because I think most of you know small Florentine satchel and what the size is. Um, it looks much smaller when it's not stuffed. Actually, this bag really does look smaller. Look at that. Does it look smaller? I guess maybe if I stuff it, it'll be a different story. But look at that. Really, it does look smaller. It does. I think it's the stuffing. I mean, come on. How can it be that much smaller? All right, guys. So that's that. I know a couple of you asked to see this when I got it. So um, Ivy Shop, you were asking. Um, and so here she is. And... Um, Vicki, I hope you get your crimson soon. I can't wait to see it. So that's that. I think I covered everything. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. Um, I don't know. I think that's it. Anyway, guys, thanks for joining me and thanks for, um, being here with me for this epic event. My last reveal. I'll do other purse videos maybe, but my last reveal or unboxing. Um, actually, maybe I have another one I can do for something I received the other day. It's not a bag, it's an accessory. So maybe I'll do that. Um, and then that's it. So um, thanks for watching guys and thanks for all your um, very kind and great comments on everything I've been doing here. Um, the vlogs, I, you know, I just think they're fun. I think it's just kind of a way of just, you know, passing the time, mostly when I'm driving. Um, and maybe documenting a few things in life that maybe someday my boys can go back and watch, you know, and kind of wish I had done it a little earlier in life, you know, because, you know, it would have been better. <laughs> um... But thanks so much again, and um, I hope you guys have a wonderful night. And for those of you that are in this terribly cold weather, stay warm. Um, and I don't know, make more videos so I can watch them. Thanks so much, guys. Bye. Hi, guys. Okay, really quick. I actually, when I shut off the video, I loaded this baby up. And I got acquainted, and let me tell you, in love, major love. Look at this. Much better, huh? This, this bag just feels great. And I love the blue. It's just such a pretty, you know, kind of a, more of a casual color because of this red zip tape. Oh my god, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, I'm in yoga pants, so, you know, nothing fancy, but look at how cute. Oh my god. All right, guys. Marine, satchel, beautiful, better in person. <sighs> Gonna be one of my favorites. I'm in love with the small satchel again, guys. For a while there, I wavered. I had two of them. Ivy and Tope got rid of them. But, you know, I had... I mean, I didn't have an Ivy, but I had my natural sandwich, and that was really close enough. Um, I kind of didn't really reach for the Tope. But this. Gorgeous. Okay. I'm, I'm going. I'm going to go get on the treadmill and... And do what I need to do to stay healthy. So, anyway, guys, have a great night. Thanks for watching. Bye.